Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. By the way, uh, Jimmy Allen, congrats. Uh, there's a post on Instagram. If you're a big Jimmy Allen fan, he's got his second number one. Uh, just um, amazing. Amazing run with his uh, latest couple of songs here and uh, just on fire. His next one um, coming real soon. I believe it's a duet with uh, Noah Cyrus and uh, just unbelievable uh, start to his career. So well done by him. Uh, We do have a few things going on here. Our final week to sign up for the road trip. My Country Caravan number two. All right, Chris Young, you want to meet him? You want dinner? You want a room? Mohegan Sun, we're going to hook it up. Plus, newcomer Peyton Smith is part of it. Uh, big machine recording artist. Suffolk Center for Speech in Stony Brook. The Stony, they have a lot of locations. The Stony Brook location, Halleck Road there in Stony Brook. And Enrico's Jewelry, William Floyd Parkway in Shirley. Been there forever. And uh, you can check out their store hours, uh, operation, and uh, where they're located and everything on our uh, socials. Instagram, Facebook, My Country 961. Got to be 21 and over to enter. Contest ends this Sunday, March 8th. Winners will be notified the following week, and uh, we're excited about it. Uh, you know when you're, um, by the way, Candy's out today. She's uh, she's sick. She's texting me, coughing, sneezing. The whole thing. So I'm like, you know what? Stay home, Candy. She's like, I'm, Brian doesn't want me to go to work. Yeah, none of us want you to go to work. How about that? Forget your boyfriend. None of us want you to go to work. Stay home. I want you fully. I know she's listening. I want you fully over any coughing or sneezing before you return to this studio. A couple things she'll be interested in when she does return. Uh, my free ride is over. My in-laws uh, have returned uh, to their home. They are uh, out of my house. By the way, I'm not saying that because I'm happy about it. Now, I, you know, they cook for me. They they uh, hang pictures on the wall, things I need done. You know, they're, they're very handy. The free ride is over. They're, uh, they're gone now again for like a month. Uh, and my son, Elijah, let me tell you, he's got his uh, second class, his second Broadway class tonight. You know, he's big into the acting and the singing and stuff. Uh, he does these camps at... Uh, I call them camps, even though they're, you know, they're during the school year because they have them in the summer, too. Uh, West Hampton Beach Performing Arts Center, amazing arts academy they have there on their website. Uh, He's already signed up for summer camp. He's got like three shows he's going to be doing this summer, and he's doing a Broadway thing there uh, that he's in now. Loves it. Just fell in love with it last week, uh, first day of camp. So um, just a little note there. If you're looking at the summer. He's already ready to go. West Hampton Beach Performing Arts Center. Uh, here's something. And maybe this goes along with talking about my son. Who knows? Within three minutes of a conversation we don't want to be involved in, we tune out. That's the time. Within th- By the three-minute mark, you're done. The top ten topics that make us tune out. Now, look, I guess it depends who's talking about it. Number one is golf. I don't mind a good conversation about golf. Like, here's one for you. Brooks Kopka, who ended the season as the number one golfer in the world, uh, not playing that well this year so far. He missed the cut this weekend. Does that excite you? It's interesting to me. Uh, Celebrity gossip is number two. Well, then you wouldn't like our bald and the beautiful entertainment. Uh, Vegan stuff is number three. Football's number four. Who put this list together? Football's number four. Fashion trends, number five. We are not interested in beauty trends, stock market, online dating, cars, and hairstyles. What else is there to talk about? By the way, things that didn't make the top ten that just missed someone else's wedding. Like when we talk about Candy's son's wedding, are you tuning out? Mortgages. Someone else's vacation. Someone else's pets. Traffic. I mean, listen, you know what? Then you hate this show. Supposedly, these, all these are the most boring topics, painful topics to listen to. I don't know who's making up this list. I could get into each and every one of these things. I think it depends on who you're talking to about it and whether the person is uh, as excited about the topic as I am. But I don't see a problem with any of these things. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.